Facebook, happy Friday. Welcome to my dirty kitchen full of groceries. So you guys love to see my grocery hauls. Like I always get the most views of my grocery hauls. And I wanted to do one today, but I didn't have time to like separate things and, and just show you what was mine. Basically, um, I need to put this stuff away. So I thought, you know what, screw it. I'm all about being real and raw and showing you guys what I eat, what my family eats, whatever. So I'm gonna put my groceries away and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. If you are jumping on live, I would love if you guys could drop a one in the comments below so I can say hi and um, let me know how you are you are doing today. And then if you are watching the replay, I would love it if you could drop a two in the comments below just so I can sit, come back and say thank you for watching because I do appreciate you guys. So this weekend, we are going to the lake tomorrow. Um, tonight, we have a family barbecue. Sunday, we're just hanging out. I kind of did a grocery haul for this weekend and for next week because I don't really want to leave. Um, although I might be getting a massage on Sunday. So I'm, I'm not going to want to go grocery shopping after my massage. That's for sure. So I went grocery shopping today. got a little bit of stuff for the weekend. Got a little bit of stuff for the week. So um, I am pretty much sticking to my plan. Hey, Bonnie, like I would say 95% at this point. Um, I'm choosing not to have any alcohol this weekend. And so I'm going to show you guys how I plan to stay on track this weekend. I get two rest days, so I won't be working out this weekend. I'm sure we'll be doing lots of swimming tomorrow. But let me show you guys what I got so I can start putting this stuff away. So if I'm opening the fridge or whatever, I have to put it away because, hey, Zach, because it is super hot here. <laughs> and everything is going to melt. Like I already put away my lunch because I don't want this to go bad. So for my lunch today, I ended up getting a poke bowl. Um, for, I, I shop at Fry's, which is like Kroger, but this looks really good. So I decided to get this for lunch. I already ate um, in the car. They had like little snack packs with hummus in it. It had um, carrots, carrots, uh, sweet peas. I want pizza. I do have pizza. Um, snap peas and apples. If you've never tried apples and hummus, it's actually really good. Okay, so I did get pizza. Um, this I probably will not eat. This is for my kids. We'll probably have this tomorrow after we get home from the lake, but I did get myself an option. Oh my gosh. There's so much stuff here, you guys. Okay. So I did get myself an option. I got myself the margarita, um, cauliflower pizza, which is so good. I will eat this whole thing by myself and I will not feel bad about it because it's that good. Okay. Um, I did get some treats for my kids. Again, I'm not like like the best, like, like I see parents feed their kids all organic stuff, no sugar, all this stuff. My kids get a little bit of everything and that's just the way it is. I'm not gonna feel overwhelmed about it if you guys saw my post earlier this morning and I'm not gonna feel guilty about it. Um, I do what I can, I do the best I can, but I do get them treats. So um, these Go-Gurts were on sale. My son is obsessed with the Sour Patch right now. So I got him these um, Sour Patch Go-Gurts. I put them in the freezer um because they like them frozen i also got a free bag of meatballs today at kroger so if you are um have a fries card a kroger a fries card they are giving away a free bag of meatballs i love this brand this is the chicken meatballs you can't really taste the difference between the chicken and the beef but i like both of them um we have these at least once a week and they all there's always enough for leftovers so those are good i'm gonna throw those in the freezer um these are not for me either taquitos the husband and the kids eat that shit <laughs> okay so what else did we get here um i got mexican style grated cheese we go through well actually to tell you the truth we don't go through as much cheese as we used to. Uh, we used to go through a lot of cheese. Hey, Kelly. Um, and now we don't go through that much. So I got that. I do get my kids Lunchables. Um, I know some people won't agree with that. That's okay. They don't live my life. I'm okay with it. So we do Lunchables for lunch and then for the lake. Also, we will have Lunchables. Okay. Oh my gosh. Wait, is this the bag? No. So for some Snacks for myself tomorrow at the lake. Um, I got these uh, these Benbitos white bean chips with a hint of lime. I've never had these before. They look really good. So I grabbed those. Um, I also got these uh, Harvest Snap Peas, Green Peas Snap Peas with a Wasabi Ranch. Um, I've tried, I haven't tried these yet, so I heard these are really good and I have tried the black pepper ones. I like those, but they have tons of flavors. Like, tell me which one is your favorite. Oh, you know what? I tried the mango chili one when we were in um, Minnesota and it was disgusting. 
So, I didn't get that. Um, okay, I saw this and I was like, I have to buy this. Like, I don't know, if you guys watch my Instagram, you already know what it is, but I had to buy this. Like, what is this? Somebody tell me, my course, my dog's gonna go crazy. It says, eat bugs. It's cheddar cricket chips. That is gross. There's 20 grams of protein per bag, four, four grams per serving. It says there's one cricket per chip. Has anybody tried these? Has anybody eaten these? I'm curious. It says one serving of chips equals one egg white. We'll see. I, I mean, I might try it. It probably doesn't taste like crickets, obviously. It's just the thought of it, like heat bugs. I don't know. Did it, has anybody tried these? Let me know in the comments below because I'm just not sure about that. Oh, I got some candy necklaces for the boys for the lake tomorrow. Okay, so since I am sober Sally this weekend, I did get he two huge things of water that I'm gonna make sure that I drink both of these tomorrow. They are 1.5 liters, so I will be drinking these. Um, I will be drinking these tomorrow. I also got some other stuff, I'll show you guys, so that I don't feel left out. So snacks for the boys tomorrow. I did get these, um, these were new, these mozzarella. No, let me know how they taste. I'm afraid to taste them, but I probably will. Maybe we'll go like live and taste them later or something, or tomorrow. So mozzarella um, cheese balls, I, that's one good thing my kids do like to eat. Or my one son likes to eat everything, but my um, oldest, he doesn't. So um, cheese is a good way for him to get protein and some fat in. I did get these little Nutter Butter thingies um, and Ritz crackers, just some regular chips, Pringles. Like you guys, like I have regular food at my house. <laughs> um, I just try to keep the stuff out of the house that I won't binge on. Um, if I can eat something, then I will. Uh, these are probably not the best for my kids, but we get these two. I told you guys, you're gonna see it all today because I need to put it away because it's so freaking hot. Okay, so I did get uh, my husband a sandwich tomorrow just because it's easy. I guess I could have made one, but sometimes I'm just lazy. So I got him that. I got these, um, they're, they're sprouts, basically. They're spicy clover and radish sprouts. These are so good, like on salads, on um, sandwiches, with your eggs, like whatever. It's so good. And this lasts me like, this will last me like almost two weeks. And there's like a lot in there and it doesn't go bad. So I love this stuff. I can't remember which one I got last time, but I got the spicy one this time. So we'll see how that tastes. I did get scones for breakfast tomorrow and I probably will end up having some of them because I am a scone, I love scones and these other cherry fruit thingies, I don't know. All right, what else do we get? I also um, don't, I buy organic when I can and if it's not cheaper or if it just doesn't seem, if it seems out of reach then I don't, I don't stress about it though. So. Um, I feel like there's something, just in my opinion, I feel like there's some things in life that you should stress about or if it's important to you. But then there comes things where like, um, like I talked about feeling overwhelmed. Like I'm not gonna feel overwhelmed about making sure that every single piece, every single thing that we eat is organic or whatever, just because that sends me into a tizzy. So I choose to do what I can with what I have and, and make those choices there. Um, I did get corn for tonight, the barbecue at family at my parents house I've been wanting to try these forever and I finally bought one I could not I, I just kept looking at them I never even picked them up to look at the back of them but these are the nourish bowls they are the Kroger brand oh this isn't the Kroger brand this is the man's brand um but this whole bowl it has cauliflower kale kohlrabi sweet potatoes black bean with chipotle corn salsa shredded cheddar cheese this whole thing is only 20 or 220 calories you guys throw some protein on there and you could eat this whole thing like it, for a meal like I'm excited to try this so if you guys have tried these um bowls let me know which ones are your favorite because that's super good like the macros or whatever calories you want to call it is pretty good on there I should have moved around my fridge before to get room for everything I got cucumbers because I love cucumbers and I'll probably just chop that up for a snack tomorrow um, I 
I got um, mushrooms because I like mushrooms. My husband doesn't like mushrooms, but that's okay. What else did I get? Like I literally threw all this stuff down and they came inside and was like, mush is alive, so we'll go away. Okay, the next thing I got is bacon. I think we're gonna have bacon on Sunday for breakfast. Yes, I eat regular bacon and yes, it fits on my meal plan. Nothing's on off limits for me. Um, I did do a really strict meal plan back in, in January through April, which I learned a lot from, but I also learned that I can't have restrictions. So um, I, do, I don't restrict myself on stuff. Like right now I'm not having alcohol, but that's just a choice I'm, I'm making. I'm not like restricting myself for a certain amount of time. Um, I'm just not doing it. So I got these raviolis. My kids love tortellini, so I was gonna see if they would eat raviolis. They're basically the same thing, but we will see what they say about that. Although I forgot sauce. Oh well. All right, I got a big thing of green beans. I've been I've been like craving different veggies lately. Like I tried zucchini last week and it just wasn't that great. Um, broccoli has been kind of hurting my stomach lately, so I'm going with a big thing of green beans. I'm gonna come up with some different ways to cook it. What's your guys' favorite way to cook green beans? Has anybody done them in the air fryer? I think that would be really good, but I need I don't know. I need that. So green beans. Going in the fridge. I bought, I finally got smart and bought a half thing of cabbage because I'm the only one that eats cabbage, but I love having cabbage like for dinner one night with cabbage, onions, and like um, mushrooms and either doing like a, like a teriyaki bowl or, or just like ground beef in general. Like I love cabbage, so, but I always waste like the other half of it. And I just realized some of this is bad, but it'll be okay. Um, so I just got the half one this time because like I said, I'm the only one that eats it. And I tend to not, not like the leftovers of the cabbage for some reason. So I don't want to make more than I will eat. I got some LaCroix. I normally do, I normally get bubbly, but I wanted to get the smaller cans because we are going in the boat tomorrow. And I do like this flavor. It's kiwi watermelon. So I will have that. You guys, this fries that we have by our house is freaking huge. It's like a Walmart. It has clothes in there, so I got a shirt. You want to see my shirt? Everything was like 60% off. I, I think I spent like two hours in the grocery store, you guys. Um, anyways, this was the cute shirt that I got, so hopefully it fits. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. So, um... Tomorrow what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make myself a salad. I'm gonna show you guys that. Um, and I'm not gonna put, have like, I was gonna do a sandwich, but I decided that I'll probably be snacky tomorrow, which means that I'll probably have my carbs in my snacks. So I won't have them like with my meals. I'll just have like veggies and whatever. So I got this uh, sea salt and black pepper, pepper popcorn. Um, the simple organic was just cheaper. So I got that used cabbage leaves instead of lasagna noodles when making lasagna. That sounds good. So I got the popcorn, I got eggs. Eggs were not on sale and I don't like buying, like eggs are the one thing that I always like go organic on. I don't know why, but I think they taste better. So I just bought one of these. Normally I would buy two or I'd buy like an 18 pack because we go through a lot of eggs. That's one thing that my oldest son will eat is eggs. Okay. I got these mini potatoes because we're gonna do steak on Sunday night. So I got mini potatoes, I got green apples um, because I like, the, I like the green apples because they have less sugar in them. They're really good like after my workout with my recover and my kids like them. So they actually like the red ones, but they can eat, they can eat these and they'll just have to survive. Okay. No, don't eat that. The dog is going to eat it orange. drinking tomorrow at the lake or this weekend in general um I love eggs too I love green apples too so I got um some kombucha I always say it wrong but I got the um brew doctor this is the super berry one I can't remember if I tried this or not but it sounded good and it'll make me feel like I'm having a cocktail so I got that I got um almond milk unsweetened vanilla almond milk. I use that for my coffee, sometimes in my shakes. It just depends. That will last me a long time because I only use a little bit. That milk is not mine. I don't drink milk. <laughs> okay, what else did I get there? 
cherries for the boat for the kids. The kids love cherries, and I figured, some of course, I would get a phone call. So cherries, and then some other drinks that I did get. Um, for some reason, when I stop drinking alcohol, I tend to go towards caffeine. I love my caffeine. Anyways, um, probably not the best switch, but um, this is what I got. Just sharing with you. I love my white monsters. You guys know that. I also got these highball, something leaked in here, and I don't know if it's one of these or what. Uh, these hot highball sparkling energy drinks. I've had them before. I've had this one before, the grapefruit, I believe it is, and it's pretty good. So I got one of those. I will not drink all of these tomorrow, you guys. My sister's coming, and I know what'll happen. She'll be like, I can I have one of those? So I got like, if she's on here, haha. But um, so I got double so that <laughs> she can have one and I don't have to be like, no, I only have one. And then I got the peach flavor one. So I got enough to share. I'm running out of room. All right. And I still have a ton of stuff to show you guys. I did get this kale salad. It's the kale salad, uh, the Asiago chopped. Um, it's kind of like a, it, well, it has a lemon garlic vinaigrette in it, but it's kind of like a Caesar salad. My husband loves Caesar salad, so I thought we would have this on Sunday with our steaks. I got these uh, clementines because the kids love them. They're also a quick after workout or snack that you can have. Orange bell peppers. I don't know if I'll cut those up for tomorrow or not. We'll see. We'll see how much work I want to put into this. Do you know, does daily affect your test? What affects your testosterone level? Caffeine? I haven't had an issue with my testosterone level, but I don't know what you're asking. Okay, so then I got avocados because I love avocado toast in the morning. And this is gonna be like my bad bag. Oh God, uh, dairy. Um, I'm not sure. It probably messes with your estrogen levels for sure. Um, and my whole family is like we have issues with high estrogen, so I stay away from stuff like that. Um, but I'm not sure about the testosterone. I got these cheap dinners for the kids, which I'm not proud of, but I got them. <laughs> Um, I got some roast beef, nothing special. I like, I like beef, you guys. Like, I could probably live off beef, and, um, I just, you know, I have a little bit of everything in my diet so that my body doesn't freak out when I have something, and I found that that's the best way that works for me. So, um, I got tortellinis, I forgot the sauce. French fries. I probably won't eat those for the kids. What else? I got so much stuff. We got ribeye steaks for Sunday night. They were on sale and they looked really good, so I decided to get those. Sometimes I'll do leaner steaks, but ribeye is probably my favorite. Actually, fillets are my favorite. Mostly when we aren't cooking them at home, though. <laughs> um, so... Actually, I've been cooking steak in the air fryer and it is freaking amazing. I've actually been cooking like everything in the air fryer. Then I also got some ground beef because I usually cook up a big batch of ground beef and uh, I was looking and this was like the leaner ground beef and it was actually cheaper than the um, fattier ground beef. So I grabbed the leaner ground beef. We'll see how that goes. Usually I get the 80-20, but this is the 93-7. I told you guys, I got a lot of stuff. <laughs> More shredded cheese. Cause I don't like to go to the grocery store multiple times. So I just like try to get as much as I can for as long as I can. So I don't have to go back. <laughs> so this is what I'm going to make for my lunch tomorrow is I got this sweet chip kale chop salad. If you watch my Insta stories, you know I'm obsessed with this. I'll probably make this whole thing. I'll add chicken, tomatoes, avocado to it. Um, and that will be my snack or my lunch for the lake tomorrow. 
but I like this salad because you can make it, you can put the dressing in it and everything, and it holds up. Like it's not gonna be like wilty or gross. Like I could even make it tonight and it'll be good for tomorrow. I got these carrot chips because these are like, it's like when you dip them into like guacamole or any kind of other dip, it's like you're eating a chip. So um, if you have issues with chips and stuff and you like the dip, get these. I use these on our road trip um, when we went to Minnesota and they were perfect. And the kids even liked them. Like they were eating them up because they look like chips. Brussels sprouts because I'm obsessed with Brussels sprouts. So I guess my question to you guys is do you guys do like a big grocery haul or do you go to the grocery store multiple times a week? Because I just, that's just not my thing. <laughs> So I got another one of those um, Brew Doctor kombuchas. This is the love. I've had this one before. It's super yummy. And um, this will be my one of my little treats. I bought two again because my sister's coming and she doesn't drink. So she'll be like, oh, can I have one of those? Uh, both. I always forget something. Me too. But then I'm just like, oh, we can live without it. <laughs> okay. Um, then I got this already cooked shredded chicken. I was going to get the salad bar because our fries is like a huge salad bar. But it's... Like nothing ever looks good on there. It's like way more expensive. And I got, yes, a big grocery haul. I got um, that salad and this, and then, then the other stuff that I could use later. And it, it ended up being a lot cheaper. So I probably could have cooked my own chicken, but you know what, it's Friday. This is my favorite salsa ever. It is the El Sol Foods um, Fresh Home Style Salsa. It's the best. And then I did get some um, guacamole for those carrots or those other chips that I showed you guys that I got. More Lunchables because it's the only way I can get my kids to eat a sandwich. They won't eat a sandwich if I make one, but if it comes like this, they will eat it. So we will take those tomorrow to the lake. Now you're getting into like, well, I guess it was all kinds of fun food. Nana's chips, if you're gonna eat tortilla chips, you need to have these. And I can actually fit these into my meal plan. Um, like for, we'll do it for like taco night and have like nachos and stuff, but this you can, I can make fit and it's so yummy. Those are the best chips ever. What are your favorite tortilla chips? Like I can't get like normal to tortilla chips now. They have to be like the Nana ones. And I got some candy for the boat tomorrow. Um, my favorite when I was a kid and we used to go camping, my weak spot is Costco. I don't even go into Costco anymore. Oh my God. Because it just, it's bad. I actually order my Costco stuff online because I end up saving money. Like I get all the snacks, all of the, um, like, what do you, like trash bags, like all of the, like the, the household stuff that you need. And I end up spending like $300 less than if I walked into Costco. Okay, so Twizzlers Pull and Pills were my absolute favorite when I was a kid. When we'd go camping, my mom would always get candy, and those were one of my favorites. So these were on sale, and I had to get them. They're the watermelon ones. And then I got some Sour Punch straws. My kids are going to be hyped up on sugar tomorrow. I think we're getting into less exciting things. This is just So this is probably it. Oh, I'll show you guys what I got at Ross. So tomatoes. I love tomatoes and so does my son. Like he'll eat this whole thing. So I have to buy two of them. Actually, I have some left over in there too. But two tomatoes. And, this is and then I got strawberries because they were on sale and they looked yummy. So I'll probably cut those up for tomorrow too. there's just some of the same stuff over there um this morning I went to Ross to try to go find some um a selfie mirror because I haven't had my broke like years ago and I, I keep saying I need one I need one I need one so I took myself out to breakfast because it's self-care Friday and I'm like I'm gonna go to Ross I'm gonna get a selfie mirror because I always see them in there and I'm like no I'll get it next time so I went there and I did not get a selfie mirror because I didn't have any good ones like I want a like a bigger one and I actually found one at Walmart the other day 
that uh, I think I'm gonna go back and get. But if you guys have a place where I should go to get a good mirror, post below because I wanna know. But I ended up getting um, these bowls because I've been eating, actually I got some clothes too. If you guys wanna see clothes, I can show you that. But um, I have been eating like lots of big salads and I don't have like a big enough bowl. So I got two of these like really big white bowls so that I could put my salads in. Cause sometimes like when you like make your food fancy, it feels better. It's like, you feel, you know, you feel like you're eating more and stuff. Um, sorry, I had a text. You feel, you just feel better when you're eating. And when you can get into that like higher, like energy vibration level while you're eating, like, I don't know, it just feels good. <laughs> so I got bowls, make your food pretty, take the time to do that. Sometimes it's just, it comes straight out of you know, the container, whatever. Um, I think that's it. So thank you guys for joining me. Thank you guys for watching. I know, uh, you guys, my, my kitchen is so dirty. Look at all that shit over there. Um, you guys always love it when I do grocery hauls. So I am going to finish putting the rest of the stuff away, clean up the kitchen and then have some lunch. I hope you guys have a great weekend. If you guys are interested in getting into my group that I'm starting in September, actually their spots already open. The group is already going, but we're not officially starting until September 17th. Send me a message because you guys were, you won't want to miss this group. Like it's going to be so much fun. So many ladies have already committed and, um, we are just going to like rock out the end of the year. All right. Have a great weekend. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.